Do you want to boost your viewer interactivity? Well, here are three ideas to do just that. If you're wondering why my outfit's different, it's because I was going to do five, and I decided I wanted to do three. So let's get into the video. We're going to make a way to check your riz. So we're going to go into our actions, add, and I'm just going to call this riz. I got space in there. Okay. I'm going to group it under my redeems just to stay organized. Okay. Then I'm going to go into core. We're going to go into logic, get random number between zero and 100. All right. And then we're going to go into Twitch. Go into chat. Send message to channel. We're going to say user. User has random number percent riz okay then we're going to go into twitch again we're going to go into users we're going to get user target for info or user info for target sorry we'll go to user put this at top okay now we can go into core go into command command triggered we'll create a new command we'll name it riz command riz we'll hit it we can give it a global cooldown of like i don't know 15 seconds so it's not spammed hit okay now whenever we hit riz let's check our riz today what's it, how, how charisma how much charisma do i have today i have 82 percent riz call me next on the list is a magic eight ball so we're gonna go ahead and start by making text document on our de uh, desktop you can put it in a folder wherever you want and i'm going to name it magic maple okay then i found this on um wikipedia it's all of the answers you can get from a magic eight ball and i'm going to copy it and i'm going to go and paste that in here and we're gonna just save it okay we're gonna exit out of that we're gonna go into our our streamer bot add a new action i'm gonna call it magic cable and we're gonna group it and redeem okay and the next thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna go into twitch your channel reward reward redemption create a new one I'm gonna call it Magic 8 Ball. Okay. Ask the ball anything. Okay, we're gonna hit OK. Hit OK. Now we're gonna go into four. Uh, file IO read random line from file okay we we'll go to our desktop find our magic eight ball hit okay okay now we want to go into twitch dot and send message to channel and then we can just do percent random line
I'm gonna make it user input so that way you can ask it a question. And then we can go in and ask her magic ball a question. Will this video get 100 likes? My sources say no. Future Rolo again. Um, this next one's actually a, a jail redeem. I don't know why I didn't explain that in the video. But there you go. The next one is a little bit more difficult and you're going to need the move plugin, move OBS plugin. So first, let's get started in OBS. I'm going to go into my nesting and I'm going to create a new browser source. One second, you can't see. Okay. A new browser source. I'm gonna call this, I don't know, jail. Pick. Okay. And we want this to be 300 by 300. That's because the profile pictures are 300 by 300. And we'll just leave it there for now. We'll put it like right here. All right. to here and add our action and I'll call this jail and we'll put it in redeemed for commands I should put in commands and we'll make a new command call it jail Okay. We'll hit. Okay. Next, we're going to want to go into Twitch user. From input. Hit add target info from input. Hit okay. Then we're going to want to go into OBS. We're gonna go into our sources, set browser source URL, and we're gonna set that to jailpick. And what we wanna put in here is target user profile image URL. Just like that. Okay. And then when we test this, It should change the profile picture. Cool. All right, let me put this back. And the next thing that we want to do is we want to get a picture from Google. So just like some jail bars. Uh, I pick I pick mine already. So I'm gonna go back into OBS. So. And um, I'm going to add an image. I'm going to call this jail bars. Okay. We're just going to put this over here for now. Or I'll put it up here actually. Out of the way. Then we want to go into filters. And again, you have to have um, the move pl plugin for this to work. We're going to add a new one. And it's going to be move. Uh, move source. I'm going to call this jail bar. Oh. I'll click OK. We're gonna get the transform. And then we're gonna duplicate this. 
or we'll just call this jail bar. Now what we want to do is we want to take our jail bars and move them down like this. And then we're going to get our transform again. Oh, you know what? More bonehead. We have to set this to the jail bar. go up and down close that we'll go into my instance we'll look for a jail cell door maybe a jail door this is gonna be loud Oh, that wasn't too bad. So let's go ahead and download that. Back and uh, streamer bot. We're gonna go into core sounds. Play sound. call it build our closing I didn't spell this by the way that wasn't me that was my instance it's really loud so we're gonna bring it down a bit that's better all right and then we probably want it to uncheck that so that way it keeps playing okay now we want to go into OBS Go into sources and go into source. Or no, it's like these scene filters. Okay. Nest. Kill bar. Okay. We'll go and hit delay. I want this to like. A good chunk of time. I think that's 10 seconds. We'll duplicate this. And then we'll set this to jail bar home. Okay, so now when we test this, nothing happens. Real nice. nice. 
to disappear after a while. There we go. Nice. Alrighty. Get your roll again. Um, this video is a mess. But if you like this and it helped you, um, go ahead and give me a subscribe. Uh, follow me on Twitch. Follow me on TikTok. Whatever. Um, I'll see you next time. Like the video? Did I say that?